Hey guys, Michael here. I haven't seen you in a few weeks here on this channel and that's, well, always a bummer. Sauce.com. But don't worry, this episode is overflowing with dongs. Things to do online now, guys. If you love maps or live on planet Earth, you will be deliciously delighted by Jason Davies' Playground of Projections. This is currently my favorite place to explore. The site is full of fantastic and illuminating ways to turn our 3D planet into a flat 2D thing. There are occasional bonuses, like the sizes of countries compared. I'm particularly fond right now of the Spillhouse Shoreline Map 21. Every point is the correct proportional distance and direction from its corresponding center, and the map is interrupted along shorelines giving a great 2D view of just how much Pacific Ocean there is. Discover what goes into filmmaking by going through an interactive experience on BreakBot. It takes you through a music video, but during the video, you can click to see who put things together. For example, if you stop right now, you can check out who the stylist was for this scene, or you can learn more about the camera rental company they use. But now, it's time to demonstrate your own creative spark with AIPoem.com. Here, you fill in blanks with words of your choice to generate deep symbolic literature, like this. Wow, that is beautiful. But I still don't really grasp what five million miles per hour is. Luckily, there's The Measure of Things, a website that helps you conceptualize the magnitude of sizes and amounts. The site will put it in context, like it's 300 times faster than the space shuttle. That's really fast, but not when compared to the speed of light, which is 150 times that amount. Now that I've better wrapped my head around five million miles per hour, let's look at five million knees. For this, I recommend photospiralysis.com. Upload a photograph to create the Drosta effect, an image that contains itself, containing itself, and so on. It has no end. You can adjust the magnification and the amount of spiral as well, but to keep tabs on outer space, there's space-dashboard.com. This constellation of widgets shows you live International Space Station feeds, where it is over the Earth, where Earth and the other planets are right now, the aurora forecast, deep space conversations we're currently having, and even who's in space right now. But what is space made of? Well, at least 4% of it is made out of this stuff, the elements of matter. This website gives you a 3D periodic table with interesting details and interactive Bohr models. But are you ready to increase your intelligence even further? Well, check out intelligence-test.net where you can challenge your brain. For example, with this one, you were given the first letters of the words in a phrase as clues to what the saying is. There are multiple tests on this site, but if you want a different kind of challenge, let's go on to rotapo.com. This site allows you to steer a cute little thing away from falling off the path. Once you step on a square, it disappears, so you cannot go on the same one twice or you will plummet. But when you do complete it successfully, you can move on to another level and then on to the hidden worlds of national parks. Here, you are taught about incredible and remote locations that you wouldn't usually have easy access to. Park rangers take you through teaching you amazing things with insane views. This park is amazing, but it's a little cold. I'm ready for the beach so I can lay on the sand. Oh my gosh, even better, I can be sand. This website, linked below in the description where links to everything in this video can be found, accesses your computer's camera, rendering you into trippy grains of real-time flowing sand. You can even change the color. That was so unexpected. To Patronus! On Pottermore.com, you can discover your personal Patronus, a charm that's a projection of all your happiest feelings. It helps fight off Dementors before they suck your soul from you. You will need to make an account, but it's really quick and easy. And once you've done that, answer a series of questions to find out what your Patronus is. And then fight off Dementors like there's no tomorrow. But luckily, there will be a tomorrow probably, and there will be a next week. The future exists, which means more dongs will come. And as always, thanks for watching. We are currently working on what will come in the second ever Curiosity Box. Honestly, it is going to be even cooler 
than the first one. I'm so excited. If you haven't already subscribed, what are you waiting for? The Curiosity Box is full of amazing science-y stuff that Jake, Kevin, and I love that we want to share with you. We choose what's in it, and we have a few of the first boxes left. Only a few, but if you order now, you will not only get that first box and this next one that we're planning, you will also get a free Vsauce a beanie. Ho, 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 nice catch, Stevens. Uh, let me put this box down so I can show you how beautiful it is. You know, I used to be a male model. I still kind of am, like right now. Vsauce beanie, that's pretty awesome. You can get one, curiositybox.com. Proceeds go to Alzheimer's research. I'm so proud of the darn thing. Check it out. I love you all, and as always, Thanks for watching.